Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I hope you guys have been enjoying the little vlog videos that I've been putting up lately. Just really trying to get a feel for my new camera. I think I have the settings down. Uh, the only thing that's kind of difficult is the lighting in my apartment. Um, it's very, very dark in here all the time. Even if I have the windows open, um, unfortunately, if I do have the blinds and curtains open, um, here in the living room, uh, my tenants, or, um, not my tenants, my neighbors can easily look into my apartment and I don't really want them kind of seeing what I'm doing. I already have people ask me a lot of questions about what I do. Uh, especially my landlord. Every time that she sees me, she's just kind of asking, oh, what is that big camera ring light in your apartment for? And oh, what do you do for work? And things like that. So I have kind of beat around the bush about that. I just recently told her, um, yes, I am an adult model and she's a bit older, so she doesn't really quite know uh, what that means. So I just explained to her, oh, I model lingerie, things like that. So I also told her I had a YouTube channel and she wanted to know how she could find me and look me up. And that's just something I'm not really too keen on her um, seeing. But if she does, she does. If she doesn't, um, cool, even better. <laughs> Uh, but there are, I did have a neighbor who used to live next door who um, was actually a member of my personal website for a while. So that was really interesting. It was a really sweet couple. They were awesome. Uh, they did move and they do contact me every once in a while. But uh, yeah, anyways, okay. So today I wanted to model a few of my dresses that I had in my closet. Uh, I have about six of them. I'm not sure if I'm going to fit them all in this video. I do have some place I need to be in like an hour, uh, and I wanted to hop on cam for a little bit before then. So anyways, let's go ahead and get started with this little dress fashion show. Okay, so for this first dress, it is a little short blue floral dress. It has this little tie accent here in the front the back of it. it. has an open back here which I really really like. It's perfect for the summer. Um, it is a little bit low cut so I'm not sure where I would really wear this out to. Uh, but as for like shooting content and things like that I think it's a really cute perfect dress for that. Here in the front is the accent little tie detail here. It's very cute. This is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite dresses. I think I got this one at Windsor. Windsor. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. <laughs> and you guys are going to have to excuse uh, my cluttered apartment. It's very small in here. So so everything is just kind of really compact together. Come here. Come say hi. Oh, he's, he's a sleepy boy. Can you say hi? Oh, his mama is so bright. It's so bright. Mm. Huh? He's having a lazy day today. Can you say hi, Bobos? sleepy boy. Okay, I'm so, so for my next dress is this little black skater type dress. Um, it does have a loose bottom down here. Up through the top it has a halter tie in the back and a zip closure um, starting about here and it goes up but it's a very open back type dress. This dress is probably my favorite dress that I have. It's just so fun. 
<laughs> it's very cute, it's very flirty, it's casual as well. You can see up here how it ties in the back and the strings are long so it can just kind of drape down the back there. And it comes up around the neck like a halter. <laughs> and for these dresses, I'm just wearing a, a very casual heel. <laughs> I love it. So this was dress number two. Let's go see the next one that I have. Okay, so for my third dress, I have this burgundy um, mid-length dress. It's a little more snug, uh, so I can't really walk too far or too fast in this, uh, but it's still very cute. It crisscrosses in the back here, which then comes up to this V mesh area in between the uh, girls. <laughs> One thing I really, really do love about this particular dress is that it doesn't ride up like some of the other dresses that I have worn. Stays down. It's snug. It's very cute. All right, guys. Now we're going to be moving on to my next dress. Alright, so some of you may recognize this dress. I did feature it in my blog uh, when I went to a wedding last summer or fall. I think it was last summer. Um, anywho, so this is a floor length long dress. Can't really show you how long. There is a slit that goes down the middle here, so it's really, really easy to walk in. Um, and with the right shoes or wedges, I can walk comfortably and I won't trip over myself by stepping on the dress. The band here, it is um, kind of meshy, see-through. Here's the back. This one crisscrosses as well, which is great. I absolutely love when dresses crisscross like that because it gives a little bit more support up here, which is uh, pretty important to me. <laughs> so here is the detail. It's a kind of has like a floral pattern here. You can see inside. All right, you guys, that is it for my little dress try on video. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know your favorite dress in the comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe so that you can get regular updates on when I post a new video. All right, guys, I hope you have a very beautiful and happy Monday, and I will see you next time. Bye.